Do you think they're selling eagles? If not, they should be selling eagles. And also, do I look like this eagle? I was trying to flare my nostrils like a beak. It's hard. Hello, it's me Aaron. Oh my god, hey! It's me, Mickey Joe Theatre. And we are here at Civic Playhouse Borough to see... Police Cops a Musical. Police Cops. We know nothing about this. No, I know that it's been a big thing at Fringe and that it's Police Cops a Musical but it's created by a group that we're called, that are called Police Cops. Yes, I don't think it's going to be like a scathing indictment on Law and Order. Or perhaps it will. But then Ben Adams is the composer for this production, the musical. Ben Adams, who you may know of, uh, for having written the score of Eugenius. Yes. Right? And boy band stuff. A1. A1. <laughs> I remember A1. This has came here directly from the Edinburgh Fringe. So we didn't see it at the Edinburgh Fringe because we knew they was coming here and we'd heard that there was more set and kind of a full version was going to be here so we're very excited and um, we know that Police Cops kind of a big Fringe staple and I'm expecting kind of wild and bonkers I think it's the comedy wild Fringe that people yeah. are used to Yeah, maybe Operation Mincemeat kind of vibes <laughs> Yeah I've heard this is stupid and I'm excited for that Yeah, before we head in we headed over to Mercato Metropolitano, which is literally across the road. There's one here and there's one in Mayfair, I believe. Not Mayfair, Marlebin, correction. But it's over there, so that you can go over there for your pre-show meal and then head over here for a show. So we've headed to Mercato Metropolitano for food. Mickey has a bowl. It was, it was aesthetic, I messed it up. And we got a guava daiquiri, which has guava, dark rum and lime in it. It's really nice. It's very easy to drink. And I've gone for an arepa, and then some sweet cheese and sweet corn balls with roast dip. Mercato Metropolitano has a big wide range of foods. It's basically like a big street food market, like what you would expect in Camden, or you might have seen in the Seven Dials market that we go to often. So it's really good if you're with multiple friends and you all kind of want different things. So you can get kind of maybe a sharing platter with different places from different, different cultures and cuisines, or just if everybody's you're with picky eaters or you all kind of fancy different things, it's really good because you can just basically choose what cuisine you want and then still all get to sit together and eat rather than go to different places. Someone can have a pizza, someone can have a pasta, someone can have Korean fried chicken. Or a wrappers. A wrappers. And there's dessert places and cocktail bars too. Yeah. Very good. So hopefully you've just seen what we had. And now it's time to head into the theatre. We think Sean's going to be here for the show, but we're not 100% because he's had travel issues. He's battling against public transport. The, uh, the earlier update was that he didn't think he was going to make it. Now he thinks he will be here on time. He's got... Oh, he's got a while yet. We're very early. We are very early, so we might go in early or roam about. There's not that much of near to the playhouse other than my car show Metropolitano. R.I.P. the pizza oven that they used to have inside this venue. Yes, yeah, so we kind of recommend maybe just stay in there for a while before coming over. Yeah, we left too soon. This is Bora and it has a twin called Elephant. Elephant is where Benjamin Button was and Ride, whereas the Playhouse Bora has existed for a lot longer. Yeah, this um, is where Operation Mitzvah was. Yeah, Elephant is the newbie. This is where Lift and Working... Because in the of, Heights? Yes, in the Heights. Carry. Lots of shows started here. Yeah. Toxic Avenger started here. Yeah, I remember the Southern Pippin. Playhouse before this Southern Playhouse. See, I never got to go to that one. I don't think that was even the original. There's, they, they keep coming back in different yeah. forms. They're like the Doctor Who of the London theatre scene. How is going to be another one that's going to open right by London Bridge Station yeah. soon, in a few years, I think. <laughs> Future Aaron here. Um, I hope you enjoyed that this vlog on Police Cops, the new musical that is at Southern Playhouse Borough. Always remember which Southern Playhouse you're going to because you don't want to get to the wrong one and then have to run to the other one. We've luckily never made this mistake so far, but I think that it's very easy to forget. Or if you've never been before, go to the wrong one. The easiest way I think to remember is just it's Borough and Elephant. Southern Playhouse Elephant is the closest to Elephant. Southern Playhouse Borough is the older venue and it's 
opposite Mercato Metropolitano. For an easy way, it is not the one that's in a set of flats. <laughs> I think that helps, I don't know. Police Cops is wild. I will say I went in with no expectations and was wowed by the wildness, kind of out there comedy. Um, it's very, very fitting of Fringe, but it has such a wonderfully realised set and costume design and it felt like it had been fully produced as well, which was really exciting because I don't think I've seen that produced a show at that theatre before. It really opened my eyes actually to what Borough is capable of because I feel like a lot of the more produced shows now open at Elephant. So it was very exciting to see that similar kind of level of production in sort of Playhouse Borough. It's not for kids. This show is not for kids, I will say that, and I, I think I think it fits a specific kind of humour. It's very crude, it's very um, out there. It's a lot of fun, but it is just on the more raucous side of comedy musical theatre. So I think if you love shows like Avenue Q and Book of Mormon, this is more your kind of show than if you're preferring something a little bit more lighter and musical comedy side like Hairspray, it's maybe not the show for you. It's more for those people that like kind of cult musicals like Rocky Horror and Toxic Avenger and that kind of out there comedy. I think it might be for you. Have you been to see Police Cops? Have you ever seen one of their earlier shows? Did you see them in Edinburgh? This show is a lot bigger than the one in Edinburgh. It is a fully formed two-act musical. It's just a lot of fun actually. I, I really was surprised how much I enjoyed it. And yeah, let me know. Um, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe down below. And yeah, I hope you have a magical rest of your day. Bye!